Hey guys, it's Lara here. Today we're going to do my nine months post-op video for my rhinoplasty nose job that I had in Toronto, Canada. So it has officially been nine months since I had my surgery. I had my surgery July 12th, 2017. It is now May 16th, 2018. So it has been just over nine months since I had my cosmetic surgery nose job. Okay, so what I had done was I had, I used to have a hump. I had my profile completely altered. It used to kind of look like this. I'll do, I'll do a little before so you know what I mean. I got the bridge narrowed. This was thicker before. And then I also got my nostrils taken in. And this is really what I wanted to focus on because I was searching and searching and searching for before and afters of nose jobs where they had the nostrils changed and I really could not find anything. And I was kind of like, well, it's a little bit risky to like fuck with my nostrils. I went ahead with it because A, my surgeon had I think he had like over 10 years of dealing with cosmetic surgeries just from the neck up. So he was an expert of nose jobs. He was very well known for being an excellent rhinoplasty surgeon, okay, in my country. And then he had a ton of before and after pictures in his gallery, had tons of evidence that he knew what he was doing, okay, that he wouldn't botch my nose or fuck it up. Oh, also, he brought my nose up and elevated my tip. He elevated it so it looks like more pointy and more up, okay? Because it used to be droopy before. So he like brought this whole part of my nose up. So I had like a full blown, full rhinoplasty with everything, pretty much everything I could do done to my nose. He did not take any cartilage from any parts of my body. He used the cartilage that was already in my nose. Um, he didn't have to like build a bridge or anything like that. I had a pretty good bridge to begin with. And it was also, I don't know the correct term, but he didn't like open my nose up. It was like all internal. Like he did everything just through my nostrils. So I didn't have a scar here from him opening my nose up. I just wanted my nostrils taken in because I felt like it would look weird if I had like really big nostrils, but the rest of my nose was small. Like I just felt like it wouldn't match and it wouldn't be harmonious and it wouldn't look symmetrical and balanced. And I wanted, the whole goal was for my whole face to look more symmetrical and balanced and just, you know, more, more harmonious. That's what I wanted. And I felt like my nose overpowered all of my other features. I love my other features. I love my eyes. I love my mouth. I love my, the whole like shape of my face. It was just my nose that I felt like was overpowering. I was very insecure about it for so long. And the whole goal was just to have a more harmonious face. That was the goal, okay? I decided to go ahead and get my nostrils done. Here is like literally the finished result. I don't think my nose is gonna change a whole lot now, okay? Maybe just a little bit, maybe a little bit more refinement in the tip. I wanna mention that it's super numb. This is numb, still, still numb after nine months, okay? Maybe like a panorama before shot. There's the front. This side's my worst side. So yeah, that is my whole nose. And you guys can see how it's gonna change. And I'll have the same lighting for the after. Okay. Um, the rest of my nose, however, is not numb anymore. Um, I don't. I don't. I think most of the swelling is gone. The only swelling that's left is still in the tip, so this is going to look even more refined, but not a whole lot. This is the finished result, okay? A lot of you on my original rhinoplasty video seemed so fucking butthurt about how my nostrils aren't perfect and they're not symmetrical and it's botched and that I should like go to my surgeon and get a refund or revision. No, you guys are more concerned about my face than I am. I am so fucking happy with what my surgeon did. My nostrils were already fucked up to begin with. If you look at my original pictures, they were already asymmetrical. There's only so much a co cosmetic surgeon can do with the nose you already have. You can't have this 
you know, large asymmetrical nose and expect you to have this like perfect Barbie nose when you get out. That's just not realistic. Please don't expect that because you will be let down. And how happy you are after a surgery depends on your expectations. It depends on what you expect. So if you expect a pristine, perfect, completely different nose that looks nothing like your old nose, you will let yourself down, you will be dissatisfied, you will be sad, you will be angry. And why do you want a cosmetic surgery to consume your entire life, take up all your energy and thought space? Is your whole like goal in life to get a cosmetic surgery? No, you're getting a cosmetic surgery so you can move on with your life, do bigger and better things so it can give you more confidence, enable you more, make you feel better about yourself and give you the energy that you're going to need to go and do things that actually matter in the world. Okay, your cosmetic surgery is just a tool that you're using to help you achieve your real goals and your real dreams in life. Now, I'm not saying like you shouldn't care about it at all because obviously you should. You should put in the right amount of research and the right amount of like thought and emotional energy and things like that. But when the surgery is done and over with, don't dwell on it and don't sit there and just be depressed with your whole life because your nose isn't exactly how you want it to be. Please don't make that mistake. You're just asking to be miserable, okay? I am so freaking happy with how my nose turns out. No, it's not perfect. No, my nostrils aren't perfect. Let me show you guys. Yes, look, okay, yes, yes, this one looks more up. This one looks more down. Who the fuck, like, I don't give a shit, okay? I started at a new place of employment um, about five months post-op. Nobody was like, oh my God, it looks like you got a nose job. Did you get rhinoplasty? Oh my God, your nose looks so surgical. Nobody says that. Nobody fucking says that. Nobody has any fucking clue that I had rhinoplasty. My nose just looks normal and it looks like a nose I was born with. Swelling, swelling. Don't be concerned when you first get your cast off. Your nose is going to look really fucked up. It's going to look fucked up. It's going to look nothing like how your nose is going to look like for say nine months post-off, for example, or a year post-off. Please be patient with how your nose settles. You're probably not going to see how your nose looks till about five months post-off. So be patient and wait the five months. So when I first took my cast off, my nostrils were really like really asymmetrical and it was quite obvious. But as the months progressed, about five months post-op, it settled and now it looks great. It looks more symmetrical. It got a lot smaller. It'll get a lot smaller, especially in this region. And it will start to look like how your nose was originally envisioned by your cosmetic surgeon. In terms of the numbness, Yes, it will feel numb and fucked up for a few months, three months, I think. It took a good three months before I felt normal, before I felt like I could breathe properly, before I wasn't always aware of my nose and the pressure and the swelling of it because even when you get your cast off, you're still gonna feel that pressure and swelling for a good three months. So don't expect to feel normal till after three months at least post-op. You guys might have some fucking like crackhead <laughs> eye bags going on like for a while it literally looked like I was doing a lot of meth because I had these like really sunken in black bags um I'll go back and get some past footage so you guys can see what I'm talking about but those bags lasted for four or five months before my body um healed them and got rid of them so be patient with the black eye bags they will go away Smile returning, smile returning. That took about three or four months, I think, before I could like smile and my lip would go up. Okay, before it was like, literally. <laughs> I look like I got fucking Botox or some shit. So give yourself three or four months. So basically all the results that you envisioned and wanted to see with your nose and your face and being back to normal, it's gonna take three or four months, okay? Do not expect um, spectacular results after a month post-op. Do not expect spectacular results even after two months. A good two, three to four months is when you're gonna see how your nose and how you're gonna like look for the rest of your life. I am so 
fucking happy. I spent 10 grand on this shit. I changed my face. I feel liberated. I feel confident. I feel so happy with my decision. And I just want to let you guys know that please do not like hinge all your happiness on your nose job, okay? Your nose is not who you are, okay? It's just a part of you. It's just a part of your body and no, you don't like it. And yes, it's affecting your self-esteem. And yes, when you get a change, your self-esteem is going to be boosted. But don't expect like all your problems to be solved when you get a new nose. It's just not how life works. Life is still going to go on. You're still going to have problems and challenges. But you're just going to have a new face to go through these problems and challenge. If you guys like have any more questions, please let me know. I would love to do like another post-up video um, answering your guys' most frequently asked questions. Some things I noticed when I got my nose job is my best friend said that it made me like look more white <laughs> because I'm half Asian and she said when I had my old nose you could tell that it was mixed with something but she said when I got my nose job I just like happened to look more white so people's perceptions of you will change um people treat me differently now I get stared at a lot more I get checked out a lot more I'm not saying that should be like the goal of your nose job, but I'm just telling you what I've observed since I got my nose job. I get a lot of compliments of being really pretty, like a lot, like a lot, way more than I ever gotten before I got my nose job. And like I said, this is not the goal, but I'm just saying like what I've personally experienced since getting my nose job. Also for YouTube, I feel so much more confident on camera. I can be so much more myself. I'm not constantly thinking, how does my nose look in the camera? Is this angle good? Is that angle good? Now I literally don't give a shit. Like I don't care. I, I feel like I look good at any angle and I can just like be free and just like be myself. Sorry if I sound like um like a deadly smoker over here. I, I just, I'm getting over like a cold. <laughs> why I sound all <laughs> and if you're interested more in post-op videos please subscribe because I'll have more I want to give like some fucked up shit that happened with my nose job these are like the bad stuff that happened with my nose job okay which I don't want to talk about in this video I'm going to talk about in the next video but I had some bad stuff happen that I think that you should be aware of these consequences okay guys thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye